Hi students, welcome to Bosco Campus Vision. I am Seema Dudley. Hope all are fine. This is my 10th video on data analytics. And in this video, we will discuss about the convergence of key trends in data analytics. The next uh, topic in data analytics is uh, convergence of key trends to big data analytics. And a convergence of key trends means it, there are a lot of factors that led to big data. According to Steve Lucas, the global executive vice president and general manager SAP database and technology at SAP says that the difference between old big data and new big data is its accessibility. Most of the companies keep large amount of information for the reference. But until recently, they stored most of that information on tapes. And it is true that the amount of data in the world keeps growing. The real change has been in the way that we access the data that we have stored and use that data to create a value from it. There are a lot of technologies available now which are able to access the tremendous amount of data and then to extract an insight from it. And uh, that information will be useful for the enterprises. And an uh, example for that technology is Hadoop. And uh, some of the factors which led to data analytics is the availability of lower cost hardwares which are able to retrieve and process the information more quickly at lower cost and uh, this is the factors that led to big data analytics that is more data less expensive faster hardwares Another factor which led to big data analytics is real-time analysis on very complex set of data and models at lower cost. And uh, according to uh, Lucas, that uh, he says that the cost of real-time data in the previous years were very high. And uh, now the real-time analytics is affordable. And uh, this led the companies to improve sales revenue, increase profits and to do better job for serving the customers. The industries uh, define the big data by using the three dimensions, volume, variety and velocity. I have explained the three dimensions in the previous videos. And uh, we can check how the troubles occur when defining the data in the first dimension, that is the volume. When defining the data by volume, there can be uh, some kind of troubles may occur. That is, uh, some people may define the volume by the number of occurrences. And uh, some other people define volume based on the number of interesting pieces of information for each occurrences and other set of people define volume by the combination of depth and width so there can be some kind of troubles in uh, analyzing the data when defining the data by volume there can be uh, some kind of troubles may occur that is some people may define the volume by the number of occurrences and some other people define volume based on the number of interesting pieces of information for each occurrences and other set of people define volume by the combination of depth and width. So there can be some kind of troubles in uh, analyzing the data. 
an assignment question connected with this uh, topic is explain the convergence of key trends in big data analytics uh, write the answers and submit through the email thank you